Hey everybody, how we doing? It's Am. I'm back. You still haven't gotten rid of me. Anyway, I'm going to talk about a small thread up haul. I finally got around to placing an order with thread up, and I got some nifty stuff. If you don't know what thread up is, it's an online thrift store. People, by whatever means, put their very nice recycled clothes on the thread up. And sometimes the stuff that you find on thread up is new with tags. So some of it, I think, may be coming from either a store or a manufacturer because they'll have a list of several of sizes. They've got things split out into sizes and types of clothing. They also have jewelry, they have shoes, they have handbags, they have other accessories. They've got women's clothes, men's clothes, kids' clothes, all manner of stuff. And unlike a regular general thrift store where people just come in and dump their bags and you're never quite sure what's going to be in them. With Thread Up, they pick the best of the stuff that comes to them and put that up on for sale, usually at massive discounts to the retailer. They will keep marking stuff down Two, the stuff that I'm going to be showing you is stuff that was all on its final markdown, which means I can't send it back, but that's okay. It all fit. It was wonderful. They have various different ways of selling the material. Um, they've even got, you know, you can buy a bulk lot box of stuff that is maybe in need of a little repair or whatever. And, you know, you get this huge, you know, they sell it by the pound. So you get this huge box of stuff that, yeah, some of it may need a little repair. And that kind of thing, though, sounds to me like it's, if you've got the cash, it's worth the chance. And there's also bags, of, you know, boxes of shoes and all manner of other things that they sell off in a separate category. But you can go through the um, listings, and there's some big name stuff. There's some inexpensive stuff. There's stuff that, you know, it's great. Anyway, let me show you what I got. I'll see you back in a minute. I've been ordering from Threada. Isn't that amazing? Anyway, I got this cami shirt and the pants that I'm currently wearing are just basic jeggings so they're the denim leggings I got this pair of Terra and Sky leggings yes very bright but they're also that really really fancy soft stuff and let me tell you thread up is a wonderful thing it really is they have amazingly good prices on stuff because they were formerly owned by someone else. I appreciate this. I don't have to actually go to the thrift store and go picking. This is great because they pick out the best stuff from donations or people that are selling their stuff off and then yeah, you know, make sure it's in good shape. It's in great condition. 
um, if you're willing to take a risk on getting some oddball stuff that may or may not fit or is not in the best shape, they have mystery boxes. You can go and pick up, you can pick up a mystery box from ThreadUp and yeah, you may not get what, you know, you're not doing your own pick. <coughs> Excuse me. But you're getting stuff that you may only need to like put a button on and you're getting a box load of it for a single price so you're getting you know this whole lot of stuff that yeah okay you're taking a chance on but you take a chance if you go to the thrift store there you go anyway among the other items I got is this lovely necklace And this cami shirt, in case you haven't figured it out yet, I like cami shirts. Got this cami. And I got this cami. And I got, oops, this pair of earrings. And I got this necklace. Almost reminds me of the stuff that I wore when I was belly dancing. Anyway, I did not spend more than $25 for the whole lot. And I'm good with that. Because I looked it up at the Terra and Sky um, leggings sell for about 16 bucks, and each one of these shirts is usually somewhere in the vicinity of seven to twelve bucks. So I've got three shirts and two pair of jeggings, and I spent less than twenty-five dollars. Me and Thread Up are best friends best friends bestest bestest I love them now I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the makeup I'm wearing no I'm not going to show you how to put it on currently I just, not today oh, well, I forgot about getting Earrings. Ha ha. Ha ha. Bloody raw. More earrings, yes. They're kind of a purpley turtle tortoise shell, so they go with this purple and green pattern and, and let's see, purple, green, white, and black pattern cami shirt. Anyway, everything that I am wearing on my face is either from a liquid or cream form everything. The foundation, the blush, the bronzer, the highlight, the eyeshadows, the lipstick, all of it. Everything. I'm thinking about starting doing a series or at least a couple of videos based on the concept of don't fear the cream because cream products yeah you are going to find some it but it's like any other product you will find some that are just the devil to try to work with you will find stuff that it will just be goopy <clears throat> you will have to find things that work with your skin if you want to wear creams but don't fear the cream give it a shot you know, especially if you've got really dry skin, because in some cases, it will hold the moisture. It is much easier on my skin than some of my other products. Give it a shot. Tell me what you think of the idea of doing the 
the series on using cream products. I might even get uppity and put a poll on the video. What do you think? And yes, my hair is all over my head today because I just felt like doing it that way. I mean, why not play with the hawk if you got a hawk, you know? Yeah, it needs some touch-up, and I need to trim the sides down again. We'll get to it. Now, don't forget, I don't have bail money. Be good.